Hello friends of Dell Shakes, it's Guillermo again with another sonnet, Sonnet 141. Uh, it's been 141 days, it's crazy to say out loud, but I just want to reinforce uh, what I said earlier, my first outing with these sonnets, um, that it's been such a blessing to be able to stay connected in this way, but also to pause, um, press pause on life and spend you know, five minutes sitting with these words and asking the questions that Shakespeare poses in some of these sonnets and hopefully grow as human beings. Um, I think he'd be very proud of us if he knew that we were growing through his sonnets. Um, so Sonnet 141 is a sonnet about love Shakespeare poses himself the question, why Why do I love you? Um, and I think it's a question that a lot of us have asked ourselves at one time or another about our siblings, our parents, our friends, um, our partners. Why do I love you? And Shakespeare, um, he goes through the senses and says, is it because of the way you look or your voice? Um, etc cetera, etc cetera. and he realizes that the senses while important tools and while they are great navigators um, they aren't that's not the least common denominator right in in, in these in love um, it's the heart it's the fact that my heart feels like it wants to be there for that person I love wants to make sure that person is taken care of that person is happy um, and so the senses, while important, are not n are not necessary. You know, the heart is necessary. If our heart stops beating, we can't. We're not alive. We can't love. And so Shakespeare says that is where love comes from. Um, and so we should follow our heart. And so here's Sonnet One Forty One. In faith, I do not love thee with mine eyes, for they in thee a thousand errors note. But tis my heart that loves what they despise, who, in despite of you, is pleased to dote. Nor are mine ears with thy tongue's tune delighted, nor tender feeling to base touches prone, nor taste nor smell, desire to be invited to any sensual feast with thee alone. But my five wits, nor my five senses, can dissuade one foolish heart from serving thee, who leaves unswayed the likeness of a man, thy proud heart's slave and vassal wretch to be. Only my plague, thus far I count my gain, that she that makes me sin awards me pain. Thanks again for your time. I hope you're all staying healthy. And make sure you go out there and vote and make your voice heard. Thank you.